Okay guys, 101 TV once again. So we have a tutorial on how to use chroma or what we call green screen. So we're gonna teach you how to apply those effects to our videos. First, let's open Adobe Premiere. The version that I'm using is Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2019. Once you reach this page, just click on File, then New, and then Project. The shortcut key for this one is Control plus Alt plus N. Then enter your desired name for your project. As you can see guys on this portion, there are four parts on this page. In this part is the source pane, the next one is the program pane, and then the timeline, and then the project pane and media browser. On this part guys, just click the icon, just like a folded paper, and then choose sequence. Then just click OK. So now we have the sequence 1. Now we're going to add a video on this project pane and media browser or just simply drag it so that you can bring this one on the source pane just go ahead and double click it then if you wanted to get just the video part only just click the icon and if you want just the audio only just click this icon so that we can bring this on this timeline but this video is kind of long it's more than an hour so we're just going to grab some clip here Click this one guys or just press the letter I. So this will be the start of the clip. So let's move a bit. Then click this one or just press the letter O. So this is the short clip that we need and we're gonna bring this on the timeline. By the way guys, if you wanted to use the original size of this video, simply select Change Sequence Settings. So if you notice guys on this upper part, the V1, V2, and V3. By the way, V stands for video. And this A1, A2, A3. This portion is for you to edit the audio. For example, you just wanted to get the video. Simply click this icon and drag it on the timeline. As you can notice guys, there's no audio included in it. So let's delete this one. Same thing with the audio. So once we drag it here, so the video is not included. So we're normally using this whenever we're trying to change the background music of the video. By the way, this letter M here, if you wanted to mute the audio, alright? And the letter S means solo, so if you wanted to edit just that part of the video. For example, you have a lot of video on this portion, so if you wanted to edit just that line only, just select S or solo. For now, let's go ahead and remove the audio. Now let's get some chroma video or the video with green screen. So let's go ahead and drag it here in Project Paint and Media Browser. As you can see guys, once we drag this one on timeline, this one also includes some audio. But we just need the video only. Let's go ahead and double click the video. It will go to the source pane. And of course, we're going to get this icon only, so that we can only get the video. 
By the way, for you to zoom this one up, just hold Alt and then the scroll up on your mouse. If you notice guys, it still has the rectangle on it, including the explosion. So this is our topic starts about the chroma or the green screen. On this left part, on the project pane and Winter browser, just look for effects. If you can't find it, just click this arrow, you can also see the effects options there. Now on the search tab, just type ultra and then you will see here ultra key. Now we're going to drag this effect on the video which are about to remove the background. And now on this source pane, go to effect controls on the bottom part you will see the ultra key there on this key color just click the black box which is the default color now click the drop tool on this one and then click the green screen see the background has been removed now now so that we can change the position of that green screen now take a look at this option on the upper part, the video effects. On this position, this is the X and Y. X is for left and right, and Y is for up and down. You can also drag this one on the position that you want it. So let's go ahead and place it here. Now let's go ahead and play the video. Well guys, if you notice, there are lots of green screen that we can use. By the way, I created a subscribe button also having the green screen or chroma. So let's go ahead and drag it here. Just like earlier, just go to effects. As you can see, you still have the ultra key here. As long as you're not changing the effects on the option. We're gonna drag this one on the video. And then on this bottom part, under ultra key, click the black box and then click the drop tool click the green screen and click OK so here it is the subscribe button So that's it guys, it's very simple. Just remember the steps on how to remove this kind of background. Thank you very much for watching and I hope that you learned something today. If you have some questions, just leave it on the comment section. Thank you very much for watching. This is 101 TV. Thank you and goodbye.